Hey everyone, meteorologist Taylor Canoose with your forecast. It's been a very soggy past couple of days and that wet weather continues through this evening. Widespread rain again expected this evening across central Iowa, maybe even a few thunderstorms in southeast to east central Iowa. The warm front is situated there and it's not out of the question that we see a brief tornado in that part of the state. It's unlikely, but something that we'll at least be keeping an eye on. We fast forward to Thursday, uh, Wednesday night into Thursday morning, just lingering light showers in mainly north central to northwest Iowa, but most of us will be dry as we begin the day on Thursday. Maybe some drizzle in a couple spots, but that's really about it. Thursday afternoon, uh, and additional thunderstorms are possible in southeast Iowa. These are not expected to be severe, but some heavy downpours are possible in areas like Ottumwa, like Albia, like Centerville as well. That should clear out as we head into Thursday Thursday night and really Des Moines probably going to be dry on Thursday, but it's going to be another cloudy day and that will keep us cooler than average. Once again, how much more rain can we expect from this evening all the way through Thursday? It's probably going to be a quarter inch or so for many of us, maybe some pockets of heavier rain where those uh, Thursday afternoon thunderstorms develop farther south and east. Here's your Thursday forecast cloudy most of the day. There could be some late day sun. Again, cooler than normal. Highs ranging from 57 in Ames to 67 in Ottumwa. We start to get warmer by Friday. We're looking at highs in the mid 70s with sunshine on Friday. Should be a great end to this work week. And as we head into the holiday weekend, continuing to trend warmer with highs in the low 80s on Saturday. Here's a look at what we can expect for the holiday weekend. There may be a few isolated thunderstorms and showers Saturday morning. That's probably most likely in northwest Iowa. Can't completely rule it out in central Iowa, though. Uh, Saturday afternoon through Saturday night into Sunday. Chances are the majority of us are dry. Looks like Memorial Day will be dry as well. Each of those days will be breezy, but they're also going to be fairly hot. Pretty good lake weather. If you ask me, you're looking at temperatures uh, in the low 80s Saturday, climbing to those mid and upper 80s Sunday, and some of us will get to the low 90s on Memorial Day. Here's your plumbing and heating 10 day forecast, and I think we may stay near 90 on next Tuesday as well. Cold front bring us, uh, uh, brings us our next good chance at showers and storms next Wednesday, and then back to the 70s for the second half of next week.